This is one of my favorite projects. Um, we're going to make these great scratch board self-portraits. Um, these are a couple examples from a couple years ago. The problem, the first thing we got to think about is how do I get my image onto my scratch board? Well, we're going to use chalk. I'm first going to spread out chalk or across the whole back of my printout of the picture we made with the threshold on Photoshop. Um, I'm going to try to get the entire thing. This is just sidewalk chalk. Uh, any chalk pretty much works. We're going to do a chalk transfer. Now I'm going to take a paper towel and I'm going to rub it in. It's okay to use your hands too if you're going to wash your hands right away. It doesn't necessarily need to go on super thick. It just needs to cover the whole paper. So you don't have to push super hard. Once I have chalk all over the back of the picture, I'm going to use some tape and tape it to my scratch board. So the chalk is touching the black of the scratch board. Now using a pen or pencil, I am going to trace the entire picture, every shape on it. Don't get overwhelmed. It won't take that long. Now, when you use your pencil across the lines and trace the shapes, the chalk you had on the back is going to come off and all the shapes you are making are going to be transferred onto the scratch board. Take your time with this. It is okay to peek sometimes um, as long as you have the tape at the top so the paper stays where it's supposed to be. Now, get the background too. I know some people aren't going to want to, but if you have a background on it, it really does kind of bring the picture together. Even, uh, you know, if, like in my beard, there's tons of tiny little, little, little spots um, where black, I'm not going to trace every tiny little one. Um, so, you, you know, you can change some little things, but keep it mostly the same. Use the same shapes that are in the printout. This will make your pose come out. This will make it really look like you when it's done. So a little bit of extra time at this spot and you'll really be happy with what you have. So yeah, when you're done, you can lift up your paper and all of the lines that I traced will be transferred right onto the paper and I will get my shapes out. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna scratch the light. The light in the paper is the white we're gonna scratch the white and leave the black. So we'll have color where the light is. But that's in our next video.